Any comes in as your pole horse, Salon and Roosevelt. Knight of the Stars and Ken Barron. JB Maguire, Woodley Cosmos behaved himself today. Jasana and Dolly Wood. So the seven two year olds are on behind the mobile, making a pretty good line as the mobile is 200 metres away from the dispatch point. Next race is race number five. It's a two-year-old mobile truck. Just the two runners going around. As the two-year-olds make their way down to the 2,000 metre starting point, down the back and behind the mobile, they are just about set to go. Start a grand purpose, puts on the green line now and they're underway and Eleanor Roosevelt began okay down on the inside. Out a little bit wider on the track being restrained with Dolly Wood, Woodley Cosmos goes back as well. On the inside then as they run down the back was Waltzing Wendy who dropped back in for a bit of cover as well. Going for JB Maguire and Double D, they're going to lead from Eleanor Roosevelt two lengths away then to Night of the Stars. Parking over on the outside was Pocket Reactor. Being followed on the inside then by Waltzing Wendy two lengths away Woodley Cosmos and Dolly Wood and Brendan Hill are last of all. Down the side past the 1600 metre mark they go on JB Maguire. Got found the top and he leads by a length and a half. Over Eleanor Roosevelt and Robbie Holmes travelling second. Three back was Knight of the Star being followed by on the inside Pocket Reactor. Then came uh, Dunsey on the inside there was Waltzing Wendy. And behind Waltzing Wendy going forward over on the outside. Dolly Wood dropped back, back in for a cover and then on the inside of it was Woodley Cosmos. So down the straight they travel now. With the dictator out in front, it is JB Maguire and the two year old going by and better the line out of Mystic Gold. Down the straight with his predicts that are by two lengths over. In second position was Eleanor Roosevelt. Third night of the stars being followed then by Pocket Reactor. Two lengths away then to Waltzing Wendy. Three lengths back to Woodley Cosmos and last was Dolly Wood. Out of the straight they cover 12 to 13 lengths first to last. And on top dictating the terms is still JB Maguire and the better's the light gelding. Past the 1000 metre mark from Eleanor Roosevelt, the filly by Chris F F Falcon Seelstad. Third on the inside was Night of the Stars, a Christian Cullen Cole. Then on the inside was Pocket Reactor, moving forward over on the outside then. As they run down the back was Dolly Wood, who didn't hesitate that time, giving a 1-1 to Woodley Cosmos, past a half mile, and last of all was Waltzing Wendy. So down the back they travel now. We're on top of the turn, it is J.B. Maguire. It's J.B. Maguire leading one length and a half. Trading on the inside was Eleanor Roosevelt. Parking over on the outer end was Dolly Wood, three back, Night of the Stars. 1-1 one, one over on the outside, then to Woodley Cosmos. Then came on the outside is uh, Eleanor Roosevelt, getting up along the passing lane then was Woodley Cosmos. A down it is JB Maguire on the inside. Night of the Stars can't get out. He's got no room. Down to the post. JB Maguire. Bit home. Night of the Stars. Over on the outside. Eleanor Roosevelt. Three lengths away then to Woodley Cosmos. And between them, Dolly Wood. Then came Pocket Reactor. And the last one to go by was Waltzing Wendy. Night of the Stars. Unlucky. JB Maguire, the winner. JB Maguire. Two year old galley. My bet is delighted. Mr. Gold. Next to Dunford. Crandall Getty is beaten home. Night of the Stars. Two-year-old Colt by Christian Cullen, Ken Barron, trainer-driver, that is race four, the two-year-old mobile wave pace.